What's going on YouTube? It's Toby A here for another video. Well, this is actually the part two because the first part was when I qualified for the GT Max and now me and my good friend Shay, AKA Brazen, we are officially in the GT Max. So if you have the opportunity, please like and subscribe. Follow me, Twitter, Instagram, Facebook, Snapchat, Toby underscore A, and I'll make sure to follow you back. But for now, me and Shay are, we're about to get down in these GT Max cars. For the life of me, I haven't had this much fun in a go-kart in a long time. A very, very long time. So I am pretty sure you're going to enjoy the battles that me and Shay are about to have. That sounds horrible. So I hop in the next cart. So far, it's running a lot better. It sounds a lot better because that last one, it was not sounding good. But just as I'm exiting the pit, Shay passes me and now the chase begins. And I know I'm supposed to take it easy, especially coming out of the pit lane. The cart's still cold, brakes are still cold, tires are still cold, but uh-uh. I can't give this guy too much room as I go wide there. I can't give him too much room because he was talking a lot of mess when we were in the car coming into, as I cut, I cut him off here, as we were coming onto the, when I was getting on track, he was talking a lot of mess. So I have to give him the gap sauce. I had to give it to him because he asked for it. So here we go. As I go through this corner right here, I was on a mission to make sure Shay stays behind me. And I believe something happened to his cart, but I didn't notice to almost a lap later, as you can see him behind me. So I notice it and I kind of slow down a little bit so he can catch back up because it won't be fair if I'm taking advantage of, you know, something going on with his cart. So I pass opponent number one. Uh, I believe this is opponent number 29, 29, yeah, 29. I pass opponent number 29 and lo and behold, who is this? Our beloved Annie. <laughs> so funny enough, she did a lot better on this last on this session. She chopped off a good amount of time. So I fast forward to when Shay finally gets back with me and then jumps ahead of me. So here we go again. The chase has resumed. And me being me, I'm not going to let him get far. So as you can see, I come in a lot better there, even though I'm carrying a lot more speed because the tires are, are warm now. So here we go through here and I believe this is probably one of the best parts on the track where I actually gain ground on him coming out of that corner into the straight. So here we go. You can see how he's on the inside because he knows if he's on the outside, I will cut in on the inside. I try to get ahead of him, but he refuses to allow me to pass him. Not cleanly at least. So he's on his full Max Verstappen. If you're going to pass me, you're going to have to, he's only going to go down with, that, with a fight. He's not going to go down easily. As you can see, he's on the inside again. He's not giving me any room to take him on the inside as I normally would. As you can see, he's on the inside again. Shay, <laughs> this is war. <laughs> this is war. So I finally got on the side of him and I kind of, I kind of forced him off. I won't say off track, but forced him to break. And then I tried to break a little bit too late there. And then I botched that corner. Don't judge me. Don't judge me. So <laughs> I was just trying to be a little bit aggressive, but it's okay. It's all right. Shay's still here and I'm going to pass him cleanly, ever so cleanly. So here we go again into this corner. I, in the back of my mind, I already know I have an advantage coming out of that corner. Um, for some reason, my car, well, maybe because of weight, um, my car accelerates faster. But then once we get to top speed, it's really, really hard for me to gain any more ground. So here we go. I don't, he put his finger up for some reason. I don't know. I was figuring maybe something's wrong. So I kind of eased off, but you know, he's all right. Of course, being defensive as normal. And he kind of slid a little bit too much there, but I guess he carried his momentum because he's still right next to me. I was thinking he would be behind me, but it's all right. He's taking narrow lines and, and he's, and he's like, he knows where I want to take outside of corners and he's intentionally blocking me. Well, it's not, it's not actually a block. It's, it's legit defensive moves, which is perfectly legal, which is fine. And this, this is something he and both of us need to practice when it comes to our league nights. 
you know we have to be able to defend positions and attack positions cleanly because if not we will get severely punished as he takes the insight here uh man i i i let him i let him live for another lap uh, but it's okay it's all right it's all right you know i thought i was going to be able to take him there but the checkered flag saved him so for this first round he was ahead round two no games as you can see we were trying to make sure we got in one more session before that rain cloud as you can see in the distance comes to destroy us so shay's ahead of me again this time i am going full i'm i'm going to use my own max verstappen mode and attack him like nothing else like no shay i am not going to let you rest i'm going to bump you i'm going to move you around you are going to concede that position by fire by force so as you can see i'm pulling on him but i wasn't to the to you know i wasn't able to get next to him the way i wanted to so i just ease off and i just wait for the perfect opportunity because i know myself it's going to come the opportunity is going to come so i don't know what happened there where so he had the inside well i had the inside there and um coming through this corner right here he's behind me i refuse to let him ahead of me and that's perfectly fine you can eat my dust shay you're going to collect some gap sauce today so after about a lap of leading i tell shay to go ahead of me so i can try to attack him and overtake him cleanly again because i want to practice that defense and attack from both of us so here i am behind him you know and into this section once shay's ahead of you it's going to be really really hard to get ahead of him unless you like force him out of the way so i know myself that in, especially in this area this specific corner right here i normally get a better exit than him and i don't know why he went so wide maybe because uh his cart was getting a little bit loose on him which does happen um especially coming into this corner right here because if you get the brakes wrong even a little bit it is going to lock up on you and i'll explain a little bit as we catch up to any and in the back of my mind you know i i decide to take it easy here thinking that okay shay is going to be a gentleman but no and he goes on the right so you know what? i'm not going to give him any room to get any more ground on me so i go on the other side and we just kind of sandwich around her <laughs> i kind of feel like that was rude but hey i'm not going to give this guy any more ground as you can see how quickly he gained ground so can you imagine had i been i stayed behind her but anyway so as i was talking about the brakes in these carts because you have to be really really careful so for about an inch right you get absolutely nothing nothing will happen for about an inch but then for another quarter the next quarter of an inch that is when the brakes actually work just think about how small a quarter of an inch is that's when the brakes work and anything more than that they lock up they will lock up on you instantly so you have to be really 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 careful so now here we go again chasing shay again for another lap and i have to give him credit because he is defending you know pretty well and i keep taking the inside there and i think something happened to his car maybe it cut off on him because he was moving pretty slowly so i believe at this moment i look over he gives me the okay so we're, we're back on to racing this corner right here is one of my favorites because you come in right here this little chicane you hit there and you hit there you can literally be almost flat going through it you have to you kind of have to break a little bit before it but once you have the cart turn in the right direction you're flat the whole way and i love that so here is my attack point i said you know what shay i'm going to get ahead of you and then wee, 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 he just he just slides right in, he just slides right in the dms right in front of me <laughs> oh man shay was not going to let me pass him very easily which is okay it's all right you know it's all in the name of good fun and you know a little bit of competition but i get him out of there he has a slow exit and i'm excited because i passed him cleanly there was no argument there didn't cut him off gave him plenty of room but i was on it so i don't know if you can see but that rain cloud is getting awfully close awfully close i'm not liking it and 
every now and then you might see a little speck of rain a little bit of a raindrop but it's all right you know it's holding off for right now which is good so like through my favorite section through here boom boom hit my apexes hit right there flat out all the way to this next braking zone boom I'm, I'm i'm loving this car i'm loving it it takes it takes some time to get used to it because it's it, acceler it accelerates a lot faster than the other one does and uh as a matter of fact in a minute as soon as we get to the start finish line i'm gonna have a side by side um of both laps my fast one of my fastest laps in the gt max and one of my fastest laps in the regular car so you can see the time difference and go Wow, look at that. A whole almost 10 seconds faster in the GT Max in comparison to the regular car. So I'm going to continue on because this lap is actually my fastest lap. And I chopped up, a, a, I can't remember how much time off, but I chopped a significant amount. And as you can see, I'm not really jerking around. I'm trying to be as smooth as possible through each corner, I'm not hopping over the curbs and everything. I'm trying to be smooth and carry my momentum through every single corner. To try to get every braking zone right, gradually transition from braking to gas or braking to acceleration. You know, this was this corner specifically was a big challenge, but I believe I got this one down packed and then coming into here a lot of times I hop over the curb a little bit and it upsets the cart, but I got that bang on. Same thing here, I normally get off the gas a little bit, let it turn and then get back on the gas and man, I was flying. As you can see, I was ready. I know that was a good lap. And boom, one minute and six seconds. And that was my fastest lap of the day. Very, very fast lap. But guess what happens? Dallas decides to rain us out. For majority of that braking zone, I was just sliding. Just sliding, the cart refused to stop, but luckily it did in time. I didn't hit a barrier, I didn't hit anybody, but it's officially a wrap. You know, there's nothing more I can do, so I just had to creep it back into the pit lane. You know, I was having a really good time. I felt like I can go maybe a little bit faster, but Dallas said, you know what? That's enough. Take your butt back to Houston. But hey, Shay, I've been to DKC. Mission complete. I've been in the GT Max. So, as you can see, uh, Dallas rained us out. We're in a rainstorm. We're in a rainstorm right now. With a little bit of hail. Oh my goodness. It probably won't stop till like late, maybe even tomorrow. But I got to try out the GT Max. What did you think? Ladies and gentlemen, that thing is so much fun. I think it's just the the, the mixture between, you know, crazy, rowdy. Yeah. Man, that thing is a riot. It's definitely rowdy. Um, oh my goodness. It takes so much brain power to like, because corners that will come up to you yeah. slowly in a regular car. Especially turn one. Turn one comes up on you fast. It's, the biggest thing is just the fact that you come up on corners so fast that your brain is kind of panicking. To figure out what to do. To do I brake? Do I gas? Do I, yeah, I what know. do I do? How am I managing to do this? I mean, obviously you have to brake, but it's just, you're also wondering like, 
Am I carrying too much speed through this yeah, corner? Yeah, you're overthinking yeah. everything. And if I drink too hard, am I gonna spin out? Because <laughs> the thick part hides you up. It, re it really does. Sure. Especially like, especially like after you get on the, for like once the RPM start getting up. Yeah. Oh yeah. my God, it's like VTEC. Yeah. You know, we did a little bit of a drag race down, down the, the, oh, the back straight. The back straight there. Into turn one. I that was awesome. It really was. Yeah. It really was. Yeah. Way too much. Yeah, there, was, there was a few moments there where I got pretty sideways. Mm -hmm. uh, I think you probably did that in your video too. Yep. I don't know how much my, my GoPro part was. Uh, we'll see. We'll see. You got video. it in there. Yeah. It was good in there. That was so. insane. You got to do it again. Next time, DLR? Yeah, DLR. I'm not DLR. All right. No. Care, you got, ladies and gentlemen, you've heard. Next yeah. time, DLR. But hey, look at this. I drove the GT Max, didn't get black back, didn't go off, didn't crash into anybody. True that. When I was in the regular car, I did. Well, actually, technically, that guy, that guy he, he guy. didn't know what he was doing. He didn't know what it was. I saw that situation there. And oh, I, my I, I barely goodness. missed it. I barely missed it. I was so angry. I was like, dang. The first thing I was like, what is this guy doing? Second thing I was like, man, now Shay's going to be like a lap ahead of me. <laughs> and I won't be able to catch up to him. <laughs> I, I wasn't even like, man, because when, when I was really trying to make sure doing that, that first uh, uh, heat we did there. Mm -hmm. I just wanted to make sure you're running a 75 to get the GT Max. Yeah. Because I, even I was I was running with you, but I was like, yeah, at some point I'm gonna move so you can just hammer you know, on. Make sure when you get the 75. Mm -hmm. But then we came around uh, the last couple of turns there. Mm -hmm. I don't know what happened. There. I feel like I avoided like two or three people. Mm -hmm. it's, it's just a blur. All I know is I just avoided like at the last minute. Mm -hmm. And did, did, he, did you guys like? It head on? Was it head on? It was head on. Like, li like literally, I was coming out of that corner. I don't know how to do it. I was coming out of that corner. You know, a lot of times when you're like full beans, yeah. you're like you're struggling for grip and you're trying to like manage the, your momentum coming out of the corner. Of I remember I was trying to be to the right of you guys so I can take you guys on the inside coming into the next yeah, corner. Yeah, I was trying to take people on the <laughs> <laughs> Whatever. So, so I was on that, and he was literally already facing me. I mind, I didn't have that much grip. So I was like, yeah. what the hell is going on? I can't. It was literally nothing. Thing I could do. I, I mean, slammed on the brakes, but you know, you slam on the brakes in those cars, you're still gonna go forward some. So. I mean, first, first, first session in that car, though, it's pretty quick. Dude. Yeah. You had, you had to play 74, you know. Yeah, I was hoping to get into 73. I think, I think I, I did a 74 too. I was trying to get like a 73 something, but right. first time around, it's all right. I'll take, I'll take a 74 too. It's all right. Yeah. We had a uh, an agreement at the beginning of the oh here we go you know I you said a sec you said a second to two realistically no, I said two to three seconds no 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 you said a second to two I realistically know, we'll have to review that tape I said <laughs> we'll, we'll review the tape uh, you know what because this, what, you, I mean, you know I can edit that and I'll be able to to to, <laughs> to replay it. realistically you have to be at least one and a half to two seconds faster okay that fair? that's fair. So that's a challenge. I gotta be one to two seconds faster than him. Shout out to Annie in the back. She picked up ten seconds on the lap. Okay. Okay, no, we no. see you. What what was the first what was the first lap? I think hers her first time was a 98 second yeah. lap. Nice. And then she dropped down to an 88. Well, I don't know what the last one was, but we can look it up online. She probably was faster because she, she looked like she was carrying a lot more speed in the corner. Where should oh, wow. we go to next? What 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 track? track Coda. Coda. We've done HKC. We have done HKC. We've done HKC. Now we've done DKC. And we got to do. A, we have to do Coda. A, 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 wait, is it AKC? HKC. A, no, A A. The AKC. A, DKC. HKC. AKC. What's Austin? Austin? They have one? No, they don't. But I was just. Shay, Shay, what are you doing? Because there is AKC. first, first there it was, is. first it was Megan, first it was Megan. There's now light, it's AKC. You saw that lightning? Yeah, I did. And this God telling you that if you laugh at my joke again, if you laugh at my joke, <laughs> I will just stand on you. <laughs> but, but no, Coda, uh, bro. Let's go out to Coda. Yeah, we got to do Coda. Um, I think out of all of them, I don't know if Coda's still my favorite yet. Uh, I don't. The GT Max kind of is making me lean more towards DKC right now. It's still fresh in my brain. Uh, for me, but for I got I have to I've, do. Go, I have to go back to Coda, man. I hate Coda. I'm not. You joking. hate it? I've, no, I've, I've, I've driven Coda. Okay. Like I've been there. I've, I've driven Coda. It was good. It was you know it felt like regular cars that like yeah. we would have here at DKC. Mm -hmm. We're going to Houston. I don't yeah. know what a fast car is gonna feel like out there. Oh man. Um, Oh and man! I've done. Uh, was it MSR? Oh yeah. Which I want to go back to that track by the way. MSR is. Because they had that yeah. bike uh, back there, which you could. Totally they have, they, you know they got new cars. Did they? 
Yeah, they, they, they have all new cars. Because remember last time it was Drift, it was Drift Central. Okay, that's well, all you did was yeah, Drift. I, I mean, I had fun in it. Like, yeah, it was, it was cool but you were not running first. You weren't. We're not running any fast time. Yeah, I wasn't running fast. Thank you. So how about this? We have to decide for the next track we go to, either Austin or um, MSR. MSR. Yeah. Mm. Which one is it gonna be? Okay. So, um, so we, we flip a coin. Uh, we're gonna flip a coin and decide where we're gonna go through next. Go to next. Um, so it's either um, Coda. Wait any later? No. <sighs> it's a Volkswagen. Volkswagen driver. Come on, man. Like out of nowhere, dude. Come on, man. It's a Volkswagen. Like, like, come on. Man. What were you expecting? Hey, yo, Volkswagen would be well, but you <laughs> the internet, bro. You don't get into feelings very easily. Really? All right. Well, till next time. Um, we're going to uh, try to make it home in this rainstorm whatever shit calls it we're gonna decide um, from a flip of a coin to see if we're gonna go to coda or msr um yeah and he definitely gotta come back to hkc and try the Praga card because it's real out there with the Praga card he has to do like a, i think a 62 or 63 second lap to qualify but i'm pretty sure you can do it right i'm pretty sure i got it right? <laughs> it's gotta drop a little bit of weight a little bit of baby fart from the arms or something okay and then we're good to go yeah, if, and if, if he can't, you know, I just suggest a little bit of, you know, erotic, erotic dancing. <laughs> it might work. Please like, subscribe his channel, Brazen. I'm going to have the information in the description. All right, you guys, we're going to wrap it up. Till next time, peace.